well, as y'all can see, we're back at the old stores. And uh, we're going to try and try to pick out one more coin just to prove to everybody that uh, our place has never really hunted out. So I don't know, you know, we might not find nothing, but we're going to try anyway. But today, I think what we're going to do is uh, I know where there's, uh, there's some schools at, and I've been told by a landowner that he had an old school on his uh, property. If we can run him down, maybe he can show us where it's at. And he told me about one another old school, and we just gonna have to kind of just look around and see if we can find these places. I know where there's one at. I think we can get permission to hunt it, and uh, we're gonna. Uh, there's just several different school sites. I guess you could say we're gonna go school hopping today. But anyway, uh, right now we're gonna hunt these old store sites again one more time before we move on and see what we can find. All right, here it is. My first coin at the old stores. It just proved that it is not never hunted, a spot is never hunted out. I found, I don't, I guess it's an old wheat penny. I can't make out, I can't make out right now what's, what, you know, whether it's a wheat or what it is, but it's got a lot of patina on it, so it's an old, it's an old, old penny. So anyway, and I'm getting some more good signals right here, so we'll come back to you in a minute. Okay, we just found this piece. I don't know what it is. It looks like some kind of jewelry piece of some kind. It's silvery looking, but I don't know. Uh, that just may be a, you know, silver plate or something. I don't know, but anyway, we'll get back with you later. All right, normally I wouldn't show you this, but uh, just to prove a point that the side has never really worked out for the second time today. See that? Of course, it's only a memorial penny, okay? It's not, it's not a wheat, it's a memorial. But still, a side has never worked out. There's still coins can be found. I also wanted to say to you guys, I've been digging trash. This place is some kind of trashy now. I think we're finna move on and see if we can find a school to hunt. We'll see y'all there. This here was the old Columbus school at one time. We're just a little, about a mile over from where the old stores are. But uh, I've hunted this one time and found a Civil War nickel. But that's about all I found here. Uh, but uh, we're not going to hunt this today. We're going to move over to another spot and uh, hunt another spot. But I just wanted to show you. See the two brick columns back there? That was the front of the school. Okay, but uh, maybe we'll hunt this another day. I just wanted to show you. All right, guys, I know it don't look like much, but uh, I want to welcome y'all to Paraloma School. And this is pretty much all that's left of it. Out there in them bushes out there is where the concrete and uh, uh, foundations and stuff used to be in steps. And this garden spot right here used to be part of the playground. So we've been to get out and hunt for a while. I wanted to show you all this. There's a big old rock falling down house right here behind where the playground used to sit. Um, but I also wanted to tell you, Paraloma is a ghost town now. Uh, years ago they had a bank here and uh, several churches and a couple of stores they had a big they had a big sawmill big lumber mill here at one time but uh the, none of that is none of that is here anymore it's just a few you know people here that have homes here there's not much here much anymore okay i just wanted to show y'all that i wasn't uh just telling y'all a tale about this being an old school site i want y'all to see this you see back up in there in that brush, you see them foundations, that foundation, concrete foundation line right there? That was where the school set. And all this right here in front of all this brush and wood and stuff that grew up around it. Well, I just found this thing. I don't know what it is. But looks like it might be some kind of homemade bracelet or something. I don't know. It may not be. I don't know. If it's a loop wire loop 
No something, I don't know what it is. There was a reason why I, there was a reason why I, I took y'all around to all these different school sites. I'm trying to prove to you that there's plenty of places to hunt if you'll just get out and look and search. Yeah, you may have to go outside of your town 20 miles, 30 miles or something, you know, but that's not far. Especially if you have a little vehicle, if you have, well, I don't know if you have a big vehicle, I don't know, you know, uh, something, a gas hog or something, you know, but uh, this is just a little community here that's not far from where I work, you know, and I live at Hope, but uh, this is about probably, I don't know, 30 miles from, from Hope. It ain't far, you know, maybe not that far, you know, but there's places around that you can hunt, and uh, I, I guess this is probably going to be it for the day. The sun's starting to go down, and I wanted to finish my video up for you. But uh, anyway, uh, I guess I'll end by saying this is Ula saying good luck with your hunting, and God bless. I wanted to tell you all, too, what you said. Uh, you just... You just showed us two schools. What you call the schools you talking about? Well, I had a couple more schools in mind I was gonna show you, but my time ran out. So anyway, that's a pretty sunset right there. Going sun going down. Right there's behind some clouds right now. It's going steadily going down on over here around Paraloma. But anyway, I'll see y'all there.